Jom ikuti saya dan Kak Fifi menyambut kedatangan bulan Ramadan. Kita akan mencuba pelbagai aktiviti yang boleh dilakukan oleh anak-anak untuk persiapan Hari Raya. Kita akan meneroka bagaimana kuasa magnet-magnet boleh menolong kami dalam membersihkan rumah dan menyiapkan hidangan istimewa untuk berbuka puasa. Tonight, we went to the Geylang Serai Ramadan Bazaar and we got to experience its amazing atmosphere. We also got the things that we needed for Hari Raya. Today is going to be an exciting day because we are going to find out what happens during Ramadan. Bulan ini ialah bulan puasa yang diberkati. Ini juga masa yang istimewa untuk kita menyediakan rumah dan juga diri kita untuk hari raya puasa. Tetapi Kak Fifi, selalunya ini semua dilakukan oleh orang dewasa kan? Well, mostly yes, but there are a lot of ways in which you and your friends can also get involved. <laughs> Baiklah kalau begitu, kawan-kawan, apabila kita libatkan diri dengan persiapan Hari Raya bersama ibu dan bapa, kita akan rasa lebih gembira pada musim ini. Now Mimi, the one thing that we must do before Hari Raya is to clean the house. Benar Kak Fifi, kita mahu bersihkan rumah kita supaya rumah akan kelihatan bersih dan cantik pada Hari Raya. Radio Mimio, we want our house to be spick and span for when the guests come to visit us during Hari Raya. Also, we'll just be a lot happier when our house is clean. Now, let me think, how can we make this more interesting? Hmm. Aha, idea! Let's all dress up as superheroes! Say hello to my super pals! Super Kiki and Super Mimi! Let's do our best superhero poses! Now, are you guys ready to clean? I'm ready! Great job! Let's go! Kawan-kawan, kita boleh menolong ibu bapa lap dan bersihkan cermin-cermin. Mimi suka menolong lakukan tugas ini kerana kita boleh menggunakan alat pembersih gelas yang magnetik. Alat ini mempunyai magnet di kedua-dua bahagian. Molekul-molekul di dalam magnet A ini semuanya menghala ke satu arah. Sementara molekul-molekul di dalam magnet B ini menghala ke arah yang bertentangan. Apabila kedua-dua magnet ini bertemu, molekul-molekul di dalam magnet A akan tertarik kepada molekul-molekul di dalam magnet B. Ini membolehkan kedua-dua alat pembersih ini melekati bersama-sama dan membolehkan kita mengelap cermin-cermin gelas dengan serentak. Wow, look at all these household items on the tray. Friends, do you know that magnetic items are all around us? You can go on a treasure hunt to find the magnetic items around you. For example, on this tray, let's find out which ones are magnetic and which ones are non-magnetic. Here's a clue. Magnetic items must be made out of materials that can be attracted to magnets. Let's try it out. Firstly, paper clips. Wow! Secondly, 
paper cups. Thirdly, metal spoons or plastic spoons. Fourthly, wooden cars. Metal cars. Wow! Fifthly, hairpins. Wow! And lastly, batteries. Wow, it looks like we do have a lot of magnetic items in our house. Great job, Super Pals! Super Kiki, thanks for helping me today! Bye-bye! Oh, Mimi, looks like our mission for today has just come in! Ah, it says here that our mission for today is in the kitchen. Kitchen for our mission? Mission in the kitchen? Let's go find out! Hey friends and parents, if you enjoyed this video, we have a ton of fun and educational videos and worksheets waiting for you at Kapfifi and Mimi.com. Dive into STEM and bilingual learning with us. Plus, all our content aligns with the Singapore syllabus so you can learn together with your children. Head over to Kapfifi and Mimi.com today to try our free chapters. Bye-bye! Jumpa lagi!